Now all new tonight at 11 o'clock, city leaders in the capital city tried to curb 24 hour convenience stores. They said it would make Hartford safer. But now one business owner is allowed to stay open overnight again, at least for now. Channel 3's Roger Suzanne and joins us now live in Hartford to explain. Roger. You know, Aaron and Mark, this open 24 hour sign may not seem like that big a deal. That is until you consider the fact that the business's owner had to take the city to court just for the right to turn it on. Business is brisk inside the Andes Mart on Woodland Street tonight, but many of the regulars we spoke with were willing to slow down for a second to celebrate. I'm thrilled. Up because of this bright light and what it means. People need the convenience of the store 24 hours a day. Until recently, this sign was dim because Hartford leaders had rejected overnight permits for most of the city's convenience stores as a safety precaution based on recommendations from the police department. So stores had to close before 12, which upset many regulars. That's a baloney uh, because everywhere you go, you have uh, semi-crimes. But on Friday, Andy's Mart scored a victory in court. A judge granted a temporary injunction which means for now, Andy's Mart can stay open overnight. I'm so excited because I live up the street. The store's manager is excited too. He claims business was down nearly 50% during the ban and he had to lay off two employees. Sales aren't quite back up to normal yet, but customers are still just now learning the store is back to 24 hours. For many, walking the aisles tonight is a pleasant surprise. It's great, especially for people like me that work the night shift and want to come in and grab convenient stuff late at night, but no, nowhere's open. Sometimes I work late and uh, you always want a little, little place to come get something on your way home. But it's unclear how long this sign will shine brightly. The injunction only lasts until a future court date when a judge could settle the matter. But at least in the court of popular opinion inside the store, Andy's Mart has plenty of support. They need to run a business. They need to make money. And in a written statement, the city's top attorney tells us we will, of course, comply with the temporary injunction granted at this particular location, and we remain willing to consider negotiated resolutions with conditions on a case-by-case -case basis. As we've always said, the granting of 24-hour permits is a question of balancing quality of life and public safety concerns with businesses' desire to maximize revenue. And by the way, I did speak with the manager of another Hartford convenience store, and he tells me that his business's owner plans to file a similar injunction. Reporting live in Hartford tonight, I'm Roger Suzanne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.